Hey friends, this is Renu Mahajan and today we are going to make rotisserie chicken in the instant pot. For my rotisserie chicken, this is what I am going to be using. Uh, this is about 4 pounds of a small bird. I am going to open it and wash it and then put our seasoning on. We will wash it in cold water. remove the anything that is in there the giblets in the cavity if they have any no they didn't put any so we are good not so much oops it should be cold water wash your chicken in the cold water and make sure that you wash your uh, shears later on after you you are done Our chicken is all washed. I'm going to use the paper towel to dry it up. This will fit perfectly in my instant pot, which is six quarts. I'm just going to pat down dry my chicken. Have to move away from here because every time I go closer to the I just squared and uh, now we have to season it. I have taken Himalayan salt, some oregano, some rosemary and some parsley, dried up parsley, coriander powder and allspice powder and a smoky chili powder and I'm going to put the black pepper on top the fresh ground pepper is perfect for the seasoning and I'm just gonna mix it up and I'll grab my coconut oil so I have taken two tablespoons of uh, um, the coconut oil. I've just warmed it up in, in the microwave. Just gonna mix it all up and put it on our bird. Just make sure that you cover all the parts and if I have some left I will just uh, put it inside as well. The spices smell so good, they're just wonderful, all these dried up spices. And uh, my bird is about uh, four pound in weight and I'm going to be using eight minutes uh, per pound so it would be about half an hour 32 minutes to be exact bird is pretty much covered and I have put some of the seasoning inside us also. It's a pretty tight cavity. Alright guys, we are ready to start our instant pot and sorted the chicken first. 
I'm just going to add a little more smoked pepper to make it more colorful so guys if you have not subscribed to my channel do so now and also press the bell icon for notifications thank you all right so uh, what we're gonna do is just put it on saute right there and once the eastern pot is uh, hot enough we are going to put our bird in I'm just going to use my little chivat because it will be easy to pick out the chicken using that. So I'll bring the chicken now. So here goes our chicken. That's right. And it will be easy for me to pick it out using this chivat tool. We are just going to leave it in for a couple of minutes on one side and I put the fresh side, uh, I should have, but then anyways, we have to do it on both the sides. So let's check it out, how it is doing. Isn't it so easy? to use your chivet. Okay. So we are going to turn over the chicken now. Just browned on one side. <laughs> Look how delicious it is looking. Okay, we're going to put it in again. So we have turned our chicken around and we are going to put it back here to saute and I'm going to put uh, a cup of uh, chicken broth at the bottom so it's going to be wonderful and uh, maybe a little bit of uh, lime, maybe half a lime and also one little onion as well to give it a nice flavor so and now we are not going to turn it around again we will cook it like that and you know this instant pot it makes everything cook so fast and our chicken is looking already cooked <laughs> But anyways, it is not cooked from inside, so I'm going to be using broth in the chicken. Our chicken is done on both the sides. I've taken it out and uh, checked it. And I, I decided to put some garlic in there too. And I'm pouring the chicken broth and I'll place all these veggies in. To give it uh, more flavor and I'm sure our kids are going to just love it now we are just going to put the lid on and put it for 30 minutes and I will come back to show you how it turns out okay so more than 30 minutes have passed and uh, it is showing me zero it has vented already so let's open it and see how our chicken is looking look at that it smells so good wow it's totally done look at that amazing chicken You know guys, what I'm going to do is, I'll put it in the oven on broil for about 5 minutes and let's see how it looks. Amazing. I just liked to brown my chicken and <laughs> one of the wings have fallen off. <laughs> and 
and see how amazing it looks so come on guys dinner is ready and uh, if you like this recipe please give me a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel and I will see you next time with another recipe and I thank you so much for watching my channel bye for now